I have built Elementor websites for some time now, and one thing I have learned is that your hosting can either make your site fly or crawl. Nearly three years ago, I moved my main Elementor website to Cloudways. And in this video, I will show you why I made that move, why I didn't go with Hostinger or Elementor hosting, and why this choice actually matters, especially if you build or host websites for clients. Before we dive into names and prices, let's first understand what cloud hosting is and why does it even matter for Elementor users. Traditional hosting is like living in a shared apartment. Everyone shares the same kitchen, bathroom, and Wi-Fi. If one neighbor throws a party, your site slows down. That's how most shared hosting works, like the lower hostinger plans. On the other hand, VPS hosting gives you your main room in that apartment, more control, but still in the same building. Dedicated hosting gives you the entire building, but it's expensive and hard to scale. Now, cloud hosting is something else entirely. Instead of your site living on just one server, where a single hiccup can knock you offline, cloud hosting spreads your websites that are out across a whole network of servers, the cloud in this case. If one goes down, the rest have your back when things get hot, like Black Friday or viral moments. And that's why cloud hosting matters. It gives you reliability, no single point of failure, speed with load balancing keeps things fast, scalability, you can grow instantly when traffic surges, efficiency, you only pay for what you use. And for Elementor users, that last point is huge because Elementor eats memory for breakfast. Elementor gives you epic design power, but it's resource hungry. On plain shared hosting, like the basic hosting plans, the editor can drag or just freeze. On true cloud hosting, you get dedicated resources, so Elementor feels fast every time. That's not just developer talk, it's the difference between loving your workflow and beating yourself up during edits. Let's talk about Hostinger. I have used it before and I still use it. It's very affordable, user-friendly, and their HPanel interface is clean. If you are just starting out or building personal projects, Hostinger is great. But as soon as your site grows, cracks starts to show. You're still on shared hosting resources. Your performance can vary depending on your neighbors. Support is okay, but sometimes slow to respond. And prices jump after the first few years. That $249 per month plan becomes $1099 or more. So while Hostinger is awesome for beginners, it just doesn't scale well for agencies and high-performance Elementor sites. You can't expect a shared apartment to handle a house party every weekend. Yes, they also have the Hostinger cloud, but you don't get to choose your cloud provider, only from a select few Hostinger servers. But with also limits on how many sites or applications you can host, monthly visitors, subdomains, limited files and folders on your storage for a capped price. Now, I know what you're thinking. Hamza, why don't you just go with Elementor Cloud? It's built by the same people. Here is the thing. Elementor Cloud sounds convenient, but it's a closed system. They use the Google Cloud infrastructure, which is solid, but they limit you on storage, bandwidth, monthly visitors, and scaling. You can't freely upgrade or downgrade resources, like Cloudways. Their pricing is fixed, you pay for the whole package, even when you're not using all the resources. Cloudways lets me scale dynamically. I can double my server resources for Black Friday and then scale down again in December. Elementor Cloud locks you into one tire unless you change the plans entirely. More power doesn't necessarily mean faster speed, it just means your site doesn't slow down when you are under pressure. So why pay for idle capacity? I would rather pay for what I actually use and that's what Cloudways offers. Now let's address the elephant in the room. Why choose Cloudways, the managed middle ground, like I call it? There are hundreds of cloud host providers out there. AWS, Google Cloud, DigitalOcean, they are powerful, but managing them directly can feel like piloting a spaceship blindfolded. That's where Cloudways comes in. Cloudways changes the game for WordPress and Elementor sites. Cloudways sits in the sweet spot between raw power and simplicity. They let you choose your cloud provider, for example, DigitalOcean, Vulture, AWS, Linode, Google Cloud Platform, the one that actually Elementor uses. And then they handle all the technical stuff, setup, optimization, backups, security patches. So I get the performance of the big cloud providers without needing to be a DevOps engineer. Here is what put Cloudways at the top for me. 
dedicated resources for each server, built-in caching and CDN for speed, ridiculously easy scaling, add RAM during busy seasons like Black Friday, and then scale back down, excellent support with live chat and ticket system, and they actually understand WordPress performance. Multiple websites, host as many as you want under one single plan. Pay as you go model, I pay for only what I use, not some inflated package. Let's be honest, Cloudways isn't perfect. No email hosting, no domains either. So you'll need a separate provider like Hostinga. And if you love cPanel, sorry, you'll have to learn a new dashboard. But once you get the hang of it, you'll never want to go back to shared hosting again. After all, you can create your own shared environment on your own server on Cloudways. If you build Elementor sites for clients, cloud hosting isn't a luxury anymore. It is a foundation for professional web business. Fewer client complaints, faster load times, more control. Cloudways gives me the performance, flexibility, and peace of mind without the stress of managing raw servers. So for me, Cloudways did not only sponsor this video, but also hits the perfect middle ground. That's why I'm sticking with Cloudways in 2026 and if you are serious about hosting performant Elementor sites with freedom to scale and only pay for what you use, it may be time you tried it out too. You get free 3 days to try it and if you decide to proceed, use the discount coupon and link in the description and save on your purchase. If you want me to break down how I configure a Cloudways server for Elementor speed optimization, let me know down in the comments below and as always, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet already and of course, see you in the next video.